fine wines. And we are going to taste the third cuvee in the Mono Varda cuvees from Tenda Lombardi. We previously tasted the Blanc de Blancs and the Blanc de Noir. So now we are going to do the Rosé. So very excited for that. So tell us a little bit about this. Yeah? Sure, yeah. So the Rosé de Saignet uh, is a 100% Pinot Noir as well. But obviously you can see the color is quite different than in the 100% Pinot Noir and the uh, Blanc de Noir. Uh, the reason for this, and it's actually a unique way to make this uh, rosé that they use, is they actually crush the grapes and leave the juice in contact with the skins for a period of uh, just, just under a day. And that allows the juice to obtain the color in, in the skins. And so it gets this kind of reddish tint, uh, which causes the color in the wine. And then they go ahead and ferment from there. Uh, the traditional process, or what a lot of other champagne uh, producers do is they actually make a white wine so they crush and remove the skins right away and it doesn't get any color and then they what they call a stain the wine with just red still wine so that they can obtain the color they want so the sanye method that they use is actually the preferred method it's just a little bit more labor intensive but it's really special and that's how you get this beautiful intense ruby color uh, that, that they get here okay well great i'm excited to try this one So you'll see, uh, you get kind of an explosion of red berry fruits, and cherries and raspberries, and just really beautiful flavors and aromas. And it's, it's kind of a, a fun treat, especially for, say, a Valentine's Day or some occasion like that. The rosé is a phenomenal food wine as well. It really pairs nicely with food, and the vibrancy of the fruit helps it uh, kind of pair that way. Does it pair well with chocolate? You could, you, know, <laughs> it's, it's, it, you could do it with chocolate, most definitely. I would suggest the wine first and the chocolate second. Very nice. So. Well, thank you again so much for joining us today, Nick. Remember to see all about Tenno Lombardi out in our January cover at greatwinenews.com. Thank you.